We're taking the Batmobile? We're taking the Batmobile? What's up everybody, I am Mike, and this is my Batman The Telltale Series custom Joker figure. Now as I just mentioned, this version isn't based on the comics, but instead on the popular two seasons of Telltale style adventure games, and sits at about 1 6 scale, which means 30 centimeters or 12 inches if you happen to be American, and I've tried to reflect that cell shaded art style as much as possible with this sculpt. Joker also has an entire custom outfit, which I have hand sewn from a purple shirt, and I've also dyed a shirt for him to wear. I wonder what Harley would think of the new color scheme. <laughs> Ultimately, I finished the outfit with the iconic orange acid flower he carries on his vest. I'm not even sure anymore if he used the acid flower or if it just was a regular old flower. Sound off in the comments below if you still remember, was that thing on his chest a real flower or did it actually spit acid? That's kind of a thing you really don't see the Joker do that much anymore. I mean, I don't think we've seen it in a movie other than the Jack Nicholson Joker. I'm not sure, did any of the other Jokers really use an acid flower? I think the cartoon was the only other one where he does that. <laughs> you are one messed up. Now, this might also be a good time to actually talk about the Telltale video game. Dun, dun, dun. It certainly is one of the more unique Batman experiences, which really focuses on the detective parts, and in typical Telltale fashion, on the relationships you have with characters. After all, you can really decide if the Joker becomes a villain or even your ally. So the game really has quite a few interesting tricks up his sleeve. 
And if you want to see how we painted this Joker head sculpt, there is a tutorial also up on my channel which goes into detail about painting the entire sculpt. <laughs> I see. You're up to bat then, Wayne. And if you want to see a full, uncut, 20 minute version of the same tutorial, you can also head on over to Patreon and support me there, where you get exclusive content, early access and of course, uncut videos. Now this version of the Joker, or John Doe, as he tends to call himself in the game, also comes with a custom crowbar, and he has been painted to reflect that cel-shaded art style in the game. <laughs> I don't think we've been formally introduced. Doe. John Doe. <laughs> I want John Doe. Joker. Sorry. Thank you all for watching, and if you haven't already, remember, like the video and subscribe to the channel, you can also now support me on Patreon as I've mentioned, and more importantly, remember, be excellent to each other.